Hey everybody, Matt Sellhorst here, Boat Dealer Profits with another Profits Co. video newsletter. I hope you like our new introduction. And um, I've got another new thing in my life. It is a, a little puppy. I'm gonna try to turn you around here and um, see if I can do this on the fly. But anyway, we've got a new puppy named Violet. Violet, come here. You can see if I try to get her in the background there, a little puppy right about there. And um, her not coming is part of this video. We got the new puppy, as many of you may know, uh, Lucy, our dog, uh, several months ago. Um, unfortunately, we had, to, uh, uh, we had to put her down. She had some cancer and some things in her belly, but we finally, as a family, decided to, to get a new puppy for the girls. And my wife and I definitely missed having a, uh, a dog in the house. Well, so now we've got this three month old little puppy in the house and we're working on training. And training a little puppy, if you've ever done it before, it's not a one time thing, it's an over and over. You have to continue to enforce and recondition and train them to do the right things that you want them to do. Going to the bathroom outside, not pooping on the rug, come when you call them. All of those little things, not chew the furniture and the rugs and your kids' little toys, becomes a problem. But over and over through repetition, we've had pretty good success training this little three-month-old puppy. It's not, the process isn't done. It'll be an ongoing process for a long, long time until those right habits get ingrained in Violet's personality, in her uh, behavior. And it's the same thing in your boat business. Do you have the right habits in your boat business? Have they been ingrained in your salespeople? Have they been ingrained in your technicians? Have they been ingrained in you? Have they been ingrained in everybody in your organization to treat the customer as the most important person in your business? To use the proper techniques, to gather everybody's contact information, to follow up on a consistent basis, to always be friendly and outgoing and open to helping the customer when you're on the telephone, regardless of your position in the organization. Are all of those habits ingrained at your boat business? And as I'm trying to train uh, Violet here, and it's an ongoing process, we're at the lake today just playing around a little bit, doing some videos. You can see Violet's running around and having a great time. She, she appears to love the water, and uh, it's been hard pressed to, to keep her out of it. But are you going through in your boat business and are you ensuring that the habits are being instilled in the people in your organization? Are you ensure you have the right habits to be as successful as you possibly could? And it's an ongoing effort. It's an ongoing effort to make sure that the salespeople present the proper way, greet their customers the proper way, that they ask for the clothes the proper way, use trial closes the proper way. All of those things are very important to be just ingrained and be habits. Goes throughout your entire organization. So my question to you is, if you don't have those habits ingrained, how are you gonna work on that to ensure that they do get ingrained? That you make them just habits? That you don't have little Violet pooping on the rug or losing a sale uh, in your boat business? That you don't have somebody that typically isn't on the phone um, not use the proper etiquette and not uh, understand how to interact with the customer, a prospect? Do you have somebody that's not gathering contact information from every single person that walks through your doors, whether it's sales, whether it's service, whether it's parts, whether it's a uh, ship store, whether it is your storage facility, whatever it is, are they gathering the information? Those are the habits that will give you a long lasting and a more successful boat business. I really hope that you're working on those habits um, and uh, we will see you next week in the Profits Cove video newsletter. Take care.